Hi guys, today we're in an abandoned farm park somewhere in Derbyshire. Won't be giving the location. Um, a lot of stuff still in here. It seems to have been empty for a very long time. But what an amazing place. So let's go show you around. This is actually the main room, one, well one of the main living rooms with the look of it. Um, the decay is mad if you look at the wallpaper there, it's actually peeling down off the walls. It's been empty that long. I couldn't tell you how long it actually been empty for but obviously for some time. Um, pretty mad. Um, this guy here is our friendly little cat. He's been here since we got here. He's drooling right now. He's obviously hungry. I don't know how long he's been in here. But he's such a loving little cat. Keeps coming for a love and stuff. Come on. My son wants to take him home and give him some food. He's obviously hungry. I took uh, my back here out of my pocket and the cat thought it was food. That's why he's drooling now. He's obviously starving. Um, when I got here, there was actually someone else here, and he says there was someone here earlier today, this morning, and the cat was here then. So, I take it, the cat is living in the house, which is a real shame. There's some family portraits there, from whoever used to live here, I guess. Um, there's, there's absolutely all sorts in this house, it's absolutely mental. Uh, if you look up here, we've still got all the coats and the hats hung up. The man's jacket is still on the stairs. The farmer's jacket, there's vehicles outside. Absolutely amazing. All the ornaments and stuff still up where they were when he was still in here. Wrong way, sorry. Uh, got a little cubby all here, all sorts of bits and bats in it. Not there's anything in this cupboard, I can't really see. And I'm not going to pull it out, I'm going to leave everything exactly where it was. Yeah, got some more coats hung up here. Absolutely amazing place, just I can't believe this place is like this around. I really can't. If you look at the wallpaper here with the patterns on, it looks like it's like 3D a little bit. Yeah. This was obviously someone's loving home at some point. Jay, can you just unhook me off that door? I've got it. Sorry, I hooked up onto the door. Um, ornaments still up on the fireplace. Absolutely crazy. Still got the kettle and stuff, the pans where they're obviously cooking. I don't know for sure, but I'm kind of guessing whoever lived here passed away. And I'm guessing it's this fella here in this picture down here. Cat's coming to say hello. Hey, cat, cat. Well, he's coming, he's back again. I feel so sorry for that cat. Same. People have obviously been in here, digging through everything. And all I've got to say to you, is you should be ashamed of yourself. To come in here and to do this is an absolute joke. All you had to do was come in, take your pictures and get out again. There was no need to make all this mess. Just ripping everything out, scavenging for whatever you can find in here. You're a joke, and you should be ashamed of yourselves. So that's the end of that rant, but that's all I've got to say. These people should be absolutely ashamed. I wonder if this is the fella as well with his horse here. So I'll move that round a bit to get the light on. I wish I'd come earlier because it's obviously a bit dark now 
and there really is so much stuff in this house it's unbelievable take it through to the kitchen here which is an absolute mess but like I say, I think a lot of this is down to the people that have been in here because obviously, as you can see, stuff has just been moved and chucked everywhere. But yeah, it just looks amazing to me, absolutely amazing. Right, I'll take you upstairs. Let me go in front of you, please. Don't forget to watch that floor at the top of these stairs. We've got a nice hole in the floor at the top of the stairs here, which we're watching out for. Right, I'll take you into the first bedroom. Got the commode chair there. Amazing clocks and all sorts. We've got the old bed which has obviously seen better days because the roof's coming down we've got cabinets and we've got this over here which I think is like wow even this chair here, I love this chair as well sat in front of the window with the old umbrella on it and you've got this cabinet, which is absolutely stunning. Old picture on top of the fireplace. Cat's back again, he's following us round. Right. It's that rock rocking, it's somewhat on that desk there. Let me just go in this one, Jay, first, and then we'll go that way. Uh, we've got this room, another, in fact I'll just take you in here, the bed, as you can see again, everything's ripped off, but look we've got the slippers and everything over there, on the angle, jewellery boxes, which have all been emptied, no shock there, to be quite honest, like I said, these people that have been in here, absolute joke as far as I'm concerned no need for it this is an absolute gem of an house it really is absolute gem and then you've got idiots who come in and just rifle to find whatever they can to steal in the drawers we've got all the stuff this one this drawer here we've got jewellery full of money and jewellery just mad all just left here all the claws women's clothes men's clothes absolutely mad my friend the cat is back again um, really do feel sorry for him but yeah what an amazing house uh, down on here. we've got all the um, ornaments still on the nightstand I'll take you into this last bedroom which has got some real gems in it as well. Every room has got the fireplace, every single bedroom, all got a fireplace. Just mad. And if I step back here, you can see the room. Got cabinets over there. Cabinets over here. And we've got the bed, but look at this on the bed, everyone. Right, we've got a little box here with keys and stuff in it. Yeah. 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 Drinking. Yes, it's got nothing else to drink, has it? Look at this picture here, amazing. I wonder if that were his wife. It says sweet roses on it. I'd Im I'm imagining that's his wife or his daughter. I'd have thought. Um, we've got more pictures which have been drawn. I'm trying to be careful because obviously these are a bit damp. 
and I don't want to damage them. They're getting worse as I get through the book, they're getting more and more damp. And like I say, I don't want to damage them, so I'm not going to go through them all. But there you go, that gives you an idea of what we're looking at. Um, flip that back up again, take you into this last bit here. This is the last one we have in the house. Uh, we've got a sewing machine over here. Boiler in still, which is amazing. See a copper boiler. I think this looks absolutely fantastic. This little tiny cabinet with all the spices and flower rack and stuff in it. That was obviously some little girl's toy back in the day, I'd imagine. Fantastic. Got more clothes in the wardrobes up here. Pictures on the walls. The place is just amazing. Um, I really wish I'd have come earlier and I'd have spent more time doing this video for you and doing the pictures I've been doing as well, because obviously I've been doing pictures as well, which has took some up a lot of my time. But yeah, there's a lot more I'd like to do. It's pretty amazing. Right, we're going to go outside now, um, so I'll end the video a second and we'll see you all outside in a minute and we'll have a look around outside before we go. Right guys, this is another part of the building. I didn't get outside. I was coming out and found this a um, bit dubious because the floor is caving in but we've got old bikes I don't think I should be walking on this floor I really don't and stuff absolutely amazing I really can't believe this place I cannot believe it at all it is absolutely astonishing can we get in this room? No. I think that might actually go into the house, into the bedroom. Yeah. Now we'll go down and out. This is like another little bit. You want me, Jay? Jay? Yeah, these are the stables and things. There's little cat friends following us everywhere we go. Oh, do he bring you there? Oop. If we go over here, we've got what looks like an old Morris here outside. that shed's collapsed on it and then over here we've got something else I don't know what this is yet sob an old sob amazing things you find eh quite sure I'll be visiting here again right all well, that's it for today uh, we're going to get back home because it's getting dark now and I've got my son with me so we'll catch you all again soon I hope you enjoyed it see you next time